Good morning, Stoner Prairie, and happy Monday. Today is October 19th. Don't forget, friends, that this week is a short week. So on Thursday, there will be no Zoom lessons, just seesaw activities sent out, and we won't have any school on Friday. That's right. Our teachers have been working really hard preparing for conferences and are looking forward to connecting with you and your grown-ups in the coming weeks. Miss Musgrove. We have some birthdays that were celebrated over the weekend. That's right, we did. Happy belated birthday to Harper Coles, Tatum Thomas, Preston Reed, Adler Natsky, and Raymond Robinson. And happy birthday today to Elizabeth Barger. Happy birthday. Miss Musgrove, you will never believe what national day it is today. What is it, Miss Schlitz? It's National Clean Your Virtual Desktop Day. Oh, wow. Tell me more. Well, as we all know, we are spending lots of time on our computers and iPads right now. And all the work we have to do can feel really overwhelming when our digital tools are cluttered. Just like schoolwork can feel overwhelming when our workspaces are cluttered. Yes. I know that my brain can get easily distracted when my desk is messy. Exactly. It's the same way with our digital tools. Having too many tabs open on our Safari app can make it hard to find what we're looking for and cause us to feel overwhelmed. It can even make it harder for our iPads to work. That's super helpful. Friends, make sure to close those tabs and quit your apps throughout the day to keep your iPad and brain working smoothly. Definitely. Well, Miss Musgrove, it's Monday, which means it's Mindful Monday. And we have another mindfulness correspondent today. Ooh, who is it? Today's mindfulness correspondent is first grader Abby Steffen, who will be joining us today to teach us the lion's breath. Over to you, Abby. I'm going to teach you how to do the lion breath. You breathe in through your nose and out of your mouth, but you stick your tongue out. Thanks, Abby. I like that one, but it's kind of hard to do in a mask. Yeah. Should we try it anyway? Of course. All right. I'll keep practicing that one at home. Agreed. Well, have a wonderful week, Stoner Prairie. Keep being safe. Being kind. Being responsible. And being a problem solver.